In this video, we show you how to make our favorite face mask. It's fast, easy, and approved by all the family. To make your face mask, you'll need a standard dinner plate. Our one is 10 and a half inches or 27 centimeters wide, but don't worry if yours isn't exactly the same, anything similar will be fine. You will also need a piece of cotton or polycotton fabric large enough to cut the size of your dinner plate. You will also need two small pieces of elastic. We're using a round three millimeter elastic, but any thin elastic will work just fine. Ours are cut to eight inches or 20 centimeters, but if you're not sure, you could cut yours longer and then adjust to fit. To cut your mask, start by drawing around your dinner plate. We're using a fabric marker, but you could use any pen or pencil. Next, you need to cut out your circle. Once your circle is cut, turn it right sides up and then fold it in half. You now need to sew around this curved edge. You can do that by hand or on the sewing machine. Next, grab your scissors and then fold your semicircle in half. Then cut along the fold to create two separate pieces. Then on each half, cut the remaining fold. Stop when you reach the stitches. Take one half and open it out so that it's right sides out. Then grab your other half and place that on top so that they are now right sides together. You now need to sew across that curve from one side to the other, but you need to leave a gap at each end. Then flip it around and repeat the same on the other side. Turn your mask through to the right side using one of the holes that we left at each end. At this stage you may want to press your mask with your iron or you could just give it a light finger press. Before adding the elastic you need to tuck the corners back inside. Ideally, you're trying to create a straight edge. Decide which side of your mask is the inside and then turn that edge towards it, creating a fold. You're going to top stitch along that edge, securing it in place and leaving room for your elastic. Now it's time to insert your elastic. To help with that, we like to use a small safety pin inserted through the middle of the elastic. This helps you to feed the elastic through the channel. Once the elastic is through, simply tie a knot and then pull on the elastic to hide the knot inside the channel. Now you just need to repeat that on the other side. And there you have it. Your mask is all finished, ready to make plenty for all the family. We hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. If you have, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel. Why not try experimenting with different size plates for different members of the family? We find a salad or side plate is great for younger children.